What's good everyone? It's your boy, your dig, four eyes, Uji's here, and boy, oh boy, has Rich the Kid taken another owl in the Uzi Beef Rich saga. Now this happened a little while ago on April the 6th, but there's been so much Cardi news and so much Uzi news since then, I haven't gotten a chance to talk about it, so <laughs> I wanted to discuss it in this video and kind of break it down, so let's get into it. Freaky little daddy twerking all on everybody. And quick shout out to my G Uzi Org. I did get this footage from him and I downloaded it from this post right here. So shout out to him for the plug. But anyway, basically what happened here was, as you can see, Rich is on live with a fan right here, and then the fan actually asks him about Uzi, and let's see how it plays out. Fire, that's hey man, I gotta ask, I got to ask. You finna drop the beat with Uzi or not? Huh? You finna drop the beat with Uzi or not? Oh shit, that pause! Look at this pause right here, oh my god. You finna drop the beat with Uzi or not? Yo. Oh god. You hear me? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. He had nothing to say. Rich literally had nothing to say. Rich did not know what to do. And that's the crazy thing about situations like this. When you put on IG Live on the spot, from a fan asking a question like this, it's so different. Because if this happened in a radio interview or something like that, Rich would have had a PR person tell him exactly what to say with the perfect media trained response. But in this case, he's just put on the spot by a fan and there's no way he could have prepared for this. Man, and I want you to take a look at this face right here, bro. This is where Rich knew what he was getting into. Look at that face. No. The answer is all in your face and all in your response. And that's Rich right there. That literally says everything about his response right there. He had no idea what to say. He had no idea what to do in this case. And it's just another alpha rich. I just want to play it one more time for you guys. Oh, it just it just sums up everything about this beef and how almost like scared rich is. This response just says everything. Drop the beef with Uzi or not? Huh? You finna drop the beef with Uzi or not? Yo. Yo, man. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it just says it everything right there, and that face says everything when Rich. Like he just does he just didn't know what to do in that case. And that's not the unfortunate thing in an IG live like that, one slip up and then all of a sudden you see all these comments right here, they're just clowning him. <sighs> Yeah, Rich the Mid definitely took an owl for this one, unfortunately. And it's just a string of owls, really, from the whole beef from start to here. And unfortunately, you know, I've done a breakdown in my other videos about how Rich's album did. Rich's album isn't doing any better. It's tanking. And right now, it isn't even on the Hot 200. It's fallen completely out of the top 200 albums on the Billboard charts, which isn't a good sign and just shows, really, it didn't pick up over time. The hits he said that were going to be on the album, not there. The hits have flopped. Overall, just not a good situation for Rich for this album. You know, as I said in my other videos, I actually like Rich a lot. Uh, I was a big fan of Rich in 2016, 2015 as well. Like his old stuff with Dex, I really, really liked. So I'm hoping he can come back with his next album and do well. But yeah, I just wanted to share this video right here. As I said, in an IG live video like this, this is really where you get the real natural answers. In a radio interview, this could be re-recorded a thousand times. So Rich gets a perfect media train response that makes him look in the best light as possible. But in an IG live like this, nah, it's just raw emotion and you can see it in Rich's face. He just didn't know what to say and he didn't want to do anything. He didn't even want to mention Uzi's name. He didn't know what to do. Let me know what you think about it in the comments below. Did Rich take another owl? Did he not take an owl? Let me know. It's been your boy, you dig. Before we finish the video, I want to give a few quick shout outs to some recent followers for my Instagram. Shout out to Ma Fudge and Fudge. Appreciate you, G. Shout out to Ben Trill Italy as well. And big shout out to my G, Troubled Son. Really cool photographer. Make sure to check out his page if you haven't. Big shout out to all you guys for showing love over on my Instagram. At your dig, if you guys don't follow your boy, make sure you go support your boy. I'm pumping out the content for y'all. Also, like button, hit that if you haven't. Subscribe, turn on notifications. You guys know the go. And you can see my Cardi Uzi Travis merch pieces on screen right now. Link in the description to copy if you're interested. And there are more videos of mine on screen. Make sure to check them out if you haven't.